Oh hey friends, welcome to a pretty miserable Monday morning and to week four of my weekly vlogs. Uh, so I'm just about to go to work now and then after work I am meeting an old friend to go for dinner which I'm really looking forward to. Um, I'm going somewhere that I've wanted to go for ages. We're going out to Brasserie Blanc. In fact this month I'm going to two restaurants that I've wanted to go for to for so long. Brasserie Blanc and I'm going to Loch Fine at the end of the month as well. Um, so I probably need to go to, on a diet in February. <laughs> um, but yeah for now I'm off to work and I will catch you later. I finished work now and I'm off to meet my friend for dinner at Brasserie Blanc. I'm pretty damn excited, so let's go. Just got back from dinner. It was so nice to have a good catch up. Um, I went for dinner with one of my friends from my old where you, from my old job where I used to work. We haven't seen each other for about three months. Uh, so we literally sat and chatted for about three hours, probably overstayed our welcome. Um, oh, was excited to go to Brasserie Blanc, wasn't I? So we walked down the high street, we were going to be there for like half five, so like proper early dinner. Um, so we were like, yeah, no need to book. We walked up and it was like in pitch black and there was a sign on the door saying that the staff had gone for their Christmas party. Um, so the, like, the closest other restaurant is Prezzo, just like just down the road. So we went in there and I've, as you'll have seen my pizza, it was so strange. It sounded really good, like quite a veggie pizza, like goat cheese, beetroot, butternut squash, um, on like a garlic base. But actually it was like, had no tomato puree at all. It wasn't very cheesy, it was like vegetable garlic bread, which is a bit odd, but it didn't really matter because we weren't really paying attention to the food anyway. The guy came over like twice to ask us for our order and we hadn't even looked at the menu. Uh, so it was just so nice to catch up with her. Um, Meg's I told you to look for my YouTube channel, so if you're watching this, make sure you subscribe, <laughs> and then you can keep up to date on my life. Um, but we will go after dinner again soon. Today we have well, Ross's dad has been round today to finish off the bits that we've bought recently. So we've now got the lights up in the other end of the room. It actually, looks really strange. It's like a really, I guess they're like LED bulbs. It looks really bright, like in that end of the room. But it's quite cool. So that's, they're like, they're basically like mini versions of like this guy and also they actually exactly match, they're like called the same thing like Hector I think as our living room light. So yeah. Um, so on the way home I got a bit excited because I was listening to Louise, Sprinkler Glitter and Jim Chapman on the radio, pretty exciting stuff from Radio 1. Um, on the way home I went to stop at the post office, which opened until like 10, which I didn't realise, so it's when the post, office, post offices open until like 10, um, because I ordered myself some books. Um, as I said before, I've really got into reading and I'm literally going through books so quickly, so I thought I'd have a little hunt on Amazon to see what I could get, so I'm just going to open my parcel. Yes! So, I've got... The Husband's Secret. Um, I basically, because I loved Gone Girl so much, I basically like, went onto Amazon and see what people were buying who had also bought and enjoyed Gone Girl. Um, Daughter, I've not heard of this one, but that came up on the recommended books. <laughs> and I'd also heard a lot about The Rosie Project, so I thought I'd give that one a go. And I know that there's other books. I think there's like a second one to read after that, so if I give that a go, and it has to be this one. Girl Online. Ever since Zoe said she was writing a book, I was really excited to read it, so can't wait to get started. I'm just about to get ready for bed now, just got my pyjamas on. Uh, so I have got the week three vlog ready to be uploaded tomorrow. I'm excited. I've been really, really like feeling getting the swing of things now. Um, I'm enjoying recording, I'm enjoying editing and I love putting them up on YouTube. Um, but I'm really tired now, I'm ready for bed. Um, so I'm gonna take my makeup off and I'm just so excited to get into bed and snuggle up with one of my new books. Um, I need to decide what to read first. It's gonna be this. So that's it for tonight. I will see you next time. 
Oh, hey friends. Um, so it feels like I haven't taken up the camera in so long. Um, this week has been so slow um, and it's been so boring. We haven't done anything. Um, the funniest thing just happened though. My, my, the, someone just knocked my door, which doesn't happen very often. It's like 20 past seven. So I was like, who is that? I went downstairs and because we've moved into a new build and well, obviously have no internet. Um, one of my neighbors just came around to like, say she'd had some luck with open rage, blah, 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 boring. Um, but basically I opened the door and she was like, oh, hi, I um, understand um, you've been trying to get your internet or maybe your family has been trying to get your internet done, which means she obviously doesn't think I'm old enough to have bought a house. So I'm not looking too old just yet, but no. That was like, it felt like when you get ID'd in the supermarket, I was like, when? Um, but anyway, um, so we're going to stay with our friends in Bristol tomorrow and so tonight I'm just going to have a bit of a chilled evening. I'm going to pamper. I've still got loads of my Lush stuff to use. So I'm going to have a bath, I'm going to do my fake tan, paint my nails. <laughs> Today and we are about to head off to Bristol to stay with our friends for the rest of the weekend um, but I'm just waiting for Ross and we're gonna have some breakfast we've got these little things it's probably really dark in here and <laughs> um, we've got these little things called pie clips ever heard of a pie clip they are like they're a bit like crumpets but they're like see pie clips they're like crumpets, but they're like really thin. So I like to experiment on a Saturday morning with breakfast. Um, since I don't work anymore on Saturdays, we've really liked sort of sitting down and having breakfast together, um, which has just been really nice. Um, we're also gonna make some smoothies. We've bought some frozen fruit though. So, so I like frozen fruit smoothies and also, it like keeps for longer, doesn't it? So you don't have to use it all at once. We've got mango chunks and summer fruits. And I've also got this passion fruit frozen yogurt, which I feel might be good if you like shoved a bit of that in as well. So I might give that a go. Um, so yeah, just gonna have some breakfast. Oh, so I used my um, Zen Tan for the second time last night. My first time I used it was for New Year's and I'm really not sure on it. I thought I'd read some really good things, heard some really good things about it, so I was like, it's gonna be amazing. Um, and it costs like 40 quid. Um, and bearing in mind, I usually use Samworks, which is like three quid a bottle of foamy stuff. Um, but yeah, I when I put it on, I, but first of all, I love my fake hand to have a colour guide because otherwise, you just don't know where you're putting it. And, and the uh, Zen Tan doesn't really have a colour guide and then I swear, like as soon as I've done it, I'm like finding streaks all over me. And also it kind of like rubs off, like if it all like clumps in one space, like it all just like rubs off, like you get this rubbery stuff. And I kept finding it last night, I was like, oh my god, like I'm going to look awful in the morning. But actually, in the morning, it's really nice. So I spent all of the night last night like, oh why have I put this on and look like an idiot in the morning. But it's a really nice colour today, so I don't know, I'm not sure. I'm so annoyed. <laughs> I made this smoothie and I don't really know what happened. It's really thick, I was trying to sort it out. And then it was done and I put the lid on and I was having a glass of water 
And so I take my head back to drink the water. Can you see? I get so annoyed when I do things wrong in the house and ruin things in the house. I just magic mark it. No, what are these things called? Magic sponge it, but that takes the paint off as well, which I did know. But I'm hoping you can't notice it when it dries. So was, then there's like paint dripping from the ceiling. Oh. Road trip time! I feel like I look a bit like a diva with my hat and my glasses. But it's really sunny. Isn't it sunny? You've got a hat and glasses on too. It is really sunny. It's a really, it's the perfect winter day today. So we are off to Bristol and we're excited to eat burgers. I'm hoping the sweet potato fries. I love sweet potato fries. Let's go. last night but we went for the most delicious burgers ever um, we went to a place called atomic burger in bristol um, and i had um, a burger with pulled pork on top it was huge and i had sweet potato fries which i've been wanting for so long they were so good and then um as like pudding we had milkshakes we had butterscotch milkshakes which came in milk bottles which was so cool and it was just it was a really cool place it was all like old school like cartoon decorations like um old school toys like there was like a zig and zag like do you remember zig and zag from big breakfast um yeah loads of cool bits it was really nice it was nice to have catch up over dinner and then we just came back and put pajamas on and had a glass of wine <laughs> and watched youtube videos which was good um not really sure what we're doing yet today what did we have for dinner last night atomic burger where are we going now five guys burger joint Burgers! <laughs> burger, burger weekend. We've had five guys and it was so good. And we're now in Oliver Bonus? Bonus? Yeah. I don't know how you say it. Milling candles. I thought, I thought this one said, but you can't no, even see it. Can't it says exotic this pig, one. and I thought it said exotic pig. This one is horrendous. El Flower and Lime, which yeah. I thought was how nice, is horrible. I could literally buy so many things here. Look at these little trinkets. Oh, yeah. They are cute. It's Clark. That's my car. your favourite colour with our favourite colour. Um, and these prints, gonna... these prints are so cool. I'm gonna buy it. <laughs> How much is it? 30 quid. I'm gonna buy it. I think we can get a bit carried away in here. We're not gonna get the cock now because it's got some marks on it. But I do you love this shop? I can't wait to go to Brighton and like look around all these kind of little shops. I grabbed it, but I was like, what did it do? I was like, sorry. Just got Ben's cookies. Time time. It's been a really good weekend, hasn't it? It's been a good weekend. We've eaten a lot of burgers though. Is that the same cat? Oh, same, same cat. cat. I've already cat 1-0 gone. I should probably explain what cat 1-0 is yeah. on here. Cat 1-0 is a game where you... The, my friend made up. Yeah, that we have to fight, find a cat. So if you see a cat, you go cat 1-0. And then the next person would be like cat 1-0. Or, or, or if you Yeah, or if you saw the next cat, it would be like cat 2-0. But hopefully that makes sense. Um, so, home time now. Oh my god, it felt like it took ages to get home. It didn't. It only takes like 
just over an hour but I it just felt like we were in the car for so long um but I had such a nice weekend ate far too much as you saw um but it was so good atomic burger on saturday was lush and um five guys today obviously amazing um we had bacon in our burgers today for the first time it was good um so tonight oh look um we, so we went to we were with katie and ian for the weekend and katie had made us something for our housewarming and it's it's good just got all my like candles lit now and the house feels all cozy um but yeah she got she made us this so it's like a, a box frame um with like what are these scrabble letters and glittery background and she used like the color that we used for our wedding so it's so sweet i've just put it there for now but i quite like it there actually but i don't know i don't know if we're going to keep it there or what um so yeah i've just been catching up on some telly hang on a minute so yeah, i'm just going to catch up on some big brother tonight hang on washing machine's deep in i'm going to catch up on some big brother and something else obviously as you saw in bristol we have a little treat for this evening. Literally, Ben's cookies are so good. Well, I hope they're as good as we remember. So, we've got these. Mmm. I'm gonna have these and have to have a glass of milk with cookies. It's like the rules, but any chocolate that I have, basically, if I have any chocolate at all, I always have to have some milk with it. Don't know why, but it goes. Although it does just make me want to make our own again. I might have to do that again this week. Although the amount of food we've eaten this weekend, I should never eat again. So that's the end of this week. I'm starting to lose track of which week it is. End of week four, I think. I hope you're still enjoying my videos. Um, if you are watching this and you want to leave a comment, please do. Or you want to subscribe so that you see next week's as well. Um, please do. Um, and I will see you next week.